Hi there, Max with A1 Website Pro here. I was just um, giving, it, giving everybody a heads up. You know, sometimes we get emails from other people. We don't know if they're legit or not. And so here we have this Robert Hamilton 5817 at gmail.com. And so you get this little warning a lot of times whenever this comes from a server. This is pretty common, you know, and it could be a legit email. Uh, but be careful when sending this message. But this, this type of email is like, uh, uses a PHP mailer that people set up on their server that you that you get in your email because your email address is entered into their database and then so, so you really don't know a lot of times if these people are who they say they are so uh, one of the good things to do is just highlight whatever text it is in the content area right click and then search Google for this keyword phrase because you know if they're sending this out to more and more people some people are going to catch on to it and post about it so if you search Google you can see right here that you know you, you can see that it's a, it's a scam job uh, you know just from the Google search results and you can also do this like if you're in your um, if you're in your website um, so let's see let's go to my website here my dashboard um, and I'll go to my comment section here as soon as it loads so I have three comments and so sometimes you don't know if these comments are legit or not and so a lot of times when it's general like this you 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 know you know that um, uh, they're the, it's spammed just from uh, you know a lot of different things so but, but but look at this superb keep writing maybe if we highlight over that right and we right click superb keep writing if you see a lot of people having that on their blog or whatever as you go down through the search results you know this is kinda of like a general statement I would never especially this is a web design company I mean whoever uses them has got to be uh, you know insane if they're out spamming people uh, making spam comments um, so here's here's another spam comment I'm gonna highlight just over the text you know a couple sentences and then I'm gonna search Google for it and uh, so here, here's here's a guy that probably was exposed, you know, or he's not exposed, but uh, he approved a comment. Um, you know, here's another uh, a guy. You know, same comment on his website. Here's another guy, same comment on his website. See, comments are indexed in websites, and then so now every one of these people have the exact same comment on their website that they approved. And now, unfortunately, these people are going to suffer the consequences of allowing a spammer's comment to go live on their website so you know basically what you want to do you want to spam these types of comments you know and and these kind of people out are out there every day but uh, that's that's one of the best ways like if you're not real sure about a message I mean obviously these are spam but if, if you're not real sure about a message you know just highlight a couple sentences of it right click and search Google for it and you could tell like if you go down through the pages and there's a lot of other people that are commenting the exact same comment or the 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 words Google indexes those sites according to the comments so we have a way to detect uh, you know if, if there's the same comment as on several other websites you know uh, you just uh, delete it you know I mean if you just look at that name you know it's a spam comment so I, I hope this helps people out on how to filter out your spam comments if you're unsure just google it and search and see how many other people become victims of these uh, scammers okay thanks Bye.